see you guys. Jasper is always late. Be punctual. It's not good. Abang Adwa. Hey, hey. I have a question. Yes. How do you maintain your curly and fluffy hair? Curly? This, this, this hair? Yeah. I use coconut oil. I use a shampoo, a very good shampoo, and uh, many more, you know? Because I don't know how to take care of my hair. I know, I can see. Uh, you want me to introduce to someone? You mean someone that can help me with my hair problems? Yes, I'll introduce you to someone. Ah. Yeah. Hey guys, I'm Jasper Spaya. And I'm Nazmi Adwa, your bus driver. And you're watching School Bus. Jasper, sit properly at the back. But I want to know where we're going today. You see my hair? Yeah. Is it nice? Uh, yeah. Okay. Today we are going to meet someone. Okay. You just follow me. You know nothing because you are a school girl. So sit at the back. But I want to sit like that. Can we go now? No, okay, no. You you must fasten your seat belt first. Okay. Okay. All right, guys. Let's go. Actually, to be uh, on this 
level in this industry. But for me, whatever I did, I've been positive in myself. I don't want to be number two, I want to be number one. So I have to work hard and fight for this industry. Abang, what is your greatest experience you ever been through throughout these 15 years of being a hairstylist? That dream come true that I see David Marcel Matumak that uh, my idol in, uh, from London in front of me is like seven years past. Today we part of our team for world education to bring that education to, to Malaysia. Wow. The last time this is my idol, now this is part of my, my team. He was your idol before and now he is part of in your my, team, yeah. guys. Yeah. Look how far dreams can actually take you. Yeah. Wow, that is so inspiring. In your entire career life, from uh, where you started to what you are now, what was the greatest challenge you ever faced? Yes. Actually, for me, uh, don't have any challenge. When you understand what you do, you love what you do, then don't have any difficult... Diffi you won't find any difficult in, in your journey, actually, because you, you love, then you understand. If you won't feel tired, you won't feel boring. You feel good, you feel energetic. So, so yeah. definitely you have your down times, your down moments. Like, how, how do you overcome it? Um, music, because uh, when I listen to music, music, I love to listen to my, my, my dad's song. So, make me remember what my dad's um, tell me from uh, from child. To make me remember, I, 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 I can't be tired because Malaysia needs us. She needs us to have all the young youngest generation. So maybe we could actually go to your saloon yeah, and yeah. then you can do it for let's me there? Yeah. Let's go? Yeah. 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 Do, let's Aba, go! Wait, wait, I have Hi. one more question. What is your question? Aba, if we colour our hair, yeah. is it good for our hair? No, we cannot <laughs> colour our hair to school. It's yeah. prohibited. Yeah. We yeah. cannot dye yeah. our hair to school. <laughs> so, so it's not good, lah, It's not good. Yeah, true, true. It's not yeah. good. Oh, okay. So let's go do my hair. We, as employee, we feel very inspired by him and feel very lucky having him around. Hi, oh, guys, so we are here at yes. Abang Shah's Saloon. Yeah. Hi, Abang so Shah. This is it. This is it. Yeah, this is my, my working place and like my home is home. I spend your home? Yeah, a lot, a lot of time here. A lot of time here? Yeah, yeah. yeah. So, can you show me? Yes. Home, let's go! So, how many years you have been opening your shop? Actually, my shop is around uh, nine years. Nine years already. Mm. See, all, all these things that you do, you have to learn or something? Yeah, do you have to learn to do all these breaks? And everything? Let's uh, start from the basic, uh, the two years uh, diploma in the academy last time. Uh -huh. All this basic. Uh, uh -huh. Then we explore. Oh. If you know the basic, then you can go straight, curve. Wow. Abang, I have always wanted to know the condition of my hair. So, can you actually tell me whether my hair is healthy or is it not healthy? Yes. Or... Because I have hair fall problems as well. When you did some chemical, it's not enough rest, so it can cause a problem to, to your scalp. So, uh, so color, uh, blow dry, iron every day, it's caused uh, a bit, a bit damage. damage. No, it's not really damage. So do you have advices for like straight hair or curly hair? How do you how, how, how keep if and maintain it? I got many dandruff, how to do? What to do? See, if you active in sport, you need to use like uh, scalp uh, shampoo, and once a month do like scalp treatment or something. So I have to come here. <laughs> yeah, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Abang, so can you tell us more about um, your experience being in this industry and how do you feel like serving people? This is yeah. this is a job scope in where you actually are serving people. You are actually yeah. doing them a service. So how do you feel like? Yes, uh, I just finished uh, with Benzulu, one of the rappers, the singer. Uh, this morning, 5 p.m. Then straight away, I shoot with you guys here. 
So normally it's my day like that. Uh, it's like my home actually. I spend uh, like 18 to 20 hours a day oh. in here. Spend. How you balance your family time and business? Uh, because I'm still single, so <laughs> <laughs> this is my, <laughs> my girlfriend. Yeah. Yeah. So your, your shop is your life, your yeah. shop is yeah. everything. It's very big. Wow, it's really, really inspiring. Abang, so Abang, can you please help me do here also like that? It's so pretty. Thank you. On both sides, is that? Yeah, on both sides. And I also want to ask you why this concept for your saloon? It's very, very in and yeah, very. I can see that too. Very in this moment, in this, yeah. in this generation right now. From where you got the inspiration to? And I just go to all my hobby, uh, painting. Because I ask people to paint all oh. my uh, inspirations, like there's the ocean film. So, Abang, you can break my whole head, right? Just turn a bit. Turn a yeah. little bit. All right. You like it? Yes. So, Abang. Yes. I have a question. How many outlets do you have? Uh, I got uh, two. One in Kiel, one in Johor. One in Johor. Oh. Your hometown? Uh, yes. My yes, hometown. One in Johor. Um, his hometown. <laughs> Our hometown. Uh, yes. Ah. Abang, how many stuff do you have? My stuff, um, from seven to eight, that people organize my time, my uh, like email, and my stuff in working place from eight, eight people. So you train them yourself, is it? Yeah. Okay. How many? We, we, we men, we, we know to do all things, no? Hmm. Right? Abang, who said men cannot be his stylist? Who said? But Okay, okay, I agree with you because I believe, Abang, you have a lot of achievements, right? Yeah. What is your recent achievement, the biggest one? Um, maybe in New York. Uh, wow. Uh, Mrs. Ben, uh, Asian Fashion Festival with Mrs. Ben, with Jimmy Choo, and Cha, and Winnie Lou. Wow. Uh, Average Time uh, Magazine London, and Zook KL. Uh, December, I just done a L'Oreal, Chris L'Oreal show in Kelsey City. 2016, I've been doing in uh, Matrix, Malaysia. In Icon, Malaysia 2013, Local Boy Achievement 2015. So, Abang, yeah. how do you feel? Yeah, what, 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 you are what so big out there, but you are so humble. How do you, how do, you do that? You are so, uh, like, yeah, you are so... Uh, you're so laid back. <laughs> How do you feel towards what you what you do yeah. towards your passion? I think just I, I just want want to be inspiration to to young uh, generation. Yeah, we are. Uh, yeah. We are, we are already inspired by you. All right, Abang. First of all, I'm really sorry. I have to take out the braids because no I cannot braid my head to school. Yeah, it's yeah, against yeah. the law. Yeah. Okay. Um. How about? Abang, you show us what is your hobby apart yeah. from work? Some uh, extreme sport, Col oh, extreme, extreme, extreme sport. Extreme sport. I thought uh, you are collecting <laughs> hair. Uh, I'm just kidding. Let's <laughs> no. go. So let's go. Funny, Abang. Oh, I, I, I'm it's just not kidding. funny, I'm just Abang. Kidding. Let's go, let's go. <laughs> Abang, okay. Let's go. What? Uh, you, you know my English is not good. Okay, hello. Okay, I will How you handsome. Feel? Uh, yeah, I, is feel, it hot? I feel okay. I feel good. You feel good, eh? Right. Yes. New style. New style. Hold on, eh? Okay. For my stuff. All right. Then you. Okay. Wow. Very straight, straight. Oh. Oh. Hey. Hey. Yes, sir. Can I help you? Hey, Jasper. I know you now. Hey. What are you doing here? Styling. Oh no 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 no! You can you just a school girl. Maybe you burn my hair. No, I am no, a no, professional no, hairstylist. No, this place is for high level. Can, can high you stop level, moving? You know? Can you relax and let me do my no, work? I cannot. You, my boss will fire me. Can you please? Are you really? serious? You work here? Yes. Please don't tell my parents. Jasper, please don't burn my hair. I love my hair. <laughs> I won't burn your hair, Bangadwa. Jasper. <laughs> You cannot move like that. No. Education is a must. Work second. Yes. You're always stubborn. Hey, I don't know what to talk to you. But my grades are good. Hey, guys! Hi. So we have Darwin 
Darwish with us today. Yeah. Darwish, please tell us about yourself. Uh, my name is Darwish Isfaris and I'm from Kedah. I'm Ooh. 17 years old. I started playing this sport at uh, 10 years old. Wow! wow you're a cricket player for the past seven wow. years. My hometown, Kedah. So what was your daily routine? Uh, we got two training sessions and two class sessions. Uh, training session we start at um, the morning at 6.45 and mm -hmm. evening session we start at 4, 4 o'clock and class session we start at 8.30 and in the evening we start at 8.30. 8 8 yeah. So basically in a day how many hours do you guys practice? Around 5 to 6 hours. Wow, that's a long time. So do you, do you, do you feel tired? How do you, how do you continue the next day? Yeah. We must close the light, switch off the light around 11 o'clock. Sleep early. Sleep, Sleep early, early, wake up early. Okay. So what was your biggest achievement? My biggest achievement is I got a best bowler for bilateral tournament. Wow. That is so cool. Yeah, and we champion for that, for that tournament. So basically what inspired you to become what you are today? Yes. Who was uh, your... Inspiration. Uh, my inspira inspiration is uh, Coach Faiz. He was his uh, national captain for national team. Mm. So there is. Maybe you can show us a little bit of your skill. Yes. That sure. Abang Ajoa can learn, maybe. Yeah, maybe. Sure. Uh, 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 let's go. Let's go. Come on. For beginners, cricket often appears complicated and very confusing. But after we had some pointers from Darwish, we soon discovered that it's not that difficult to understand. And it's actually really, really, really fun. Ah, so this is where you always come to. Abang, what makes this place so interesting? Because uh, that's my hobby, then I can mix all with my friends here. Hey, Abang Adwa. <laughs> With your friends here, yeah, you hang friends, out. Yeah, hang out. All so the what? young young kids are here. Mm, what else do you do here? Yes, sometimes play skateboard, bicycle, then you can mix around with the kids. You know, like can be can inspired. Like... So well, to, to, to it's a good sport because I'm sweating a lot. Yeah. Yes, it's a good you. exercise. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> it's a good exercise too. Yeah. So how many laps did you do? Uh, I don't know, uh, around 10. <laughs> good, good. So Abang, apart from um, you liking to hang out here and to cycle around here, what inspired you to actually like this sport? What inspired me? Because that um, there's only things that all my friends here oh. so mix around. So, ah. yeah. uh, my community is, is here actually. I see because your friends, your friends are all yeah, here. So whenever friends, you come yeah. here, you feel more happy, yeah. more energetic, the youthful vibe. Yeah. Uh, so Abang good. Adwa, if you want to maintain your youth, yeah. you have to come here and yeah. cycle. Yes, Stop. Abang, can you show us? Abang, <laughs> you show us. Abang. So Abang, why extreme sport? Why extreme sport? Um, because that's the only sport that I start from from young. That's uh, the sport that I, I understand so how to play. Uh, it's not professional, but I, I know how uh, how to play. Then that's some my hobby and for exercise. Ah, so Abang, looking at how how you ride your bicycle yeah. just now and everything, it was really really scary. Yeah. It it was so dangerous. Yeah. So, can you tell us uh, what was the worst accident, or yeah. have you ever met in any injuries or anything? Uh, actually, I don't have any serious injury in this because I'm not doing for professionally, just for fun just and for, fun. Yeah, for exercise. And that's a normal, a simple slide down. So, for how many years has this has this been your hobby? Yeah, I started when I was. Um, like nine years old, I think. Wow, it's not just, uh, nine just years fun, old. Yeah. 
Like everybody, kids, uh, they are playing bicycle, they are just going. Uh. So what inspired you to like this hobby? Yeah, what inspired me? Because I, I love uh, extreme, extreme sport. I mean, like bicycles, uh, mountain bike down here, uh, skateboarding. So, Abang Shah, these kind of extreme sports are really, really rare. So, what would you say to kids who actually want to play extreme sports just like you? <laughs> actually, if you need to play this for professionally, you need to have a, a coach yeah, for this. Uh, a coach. Yeah, yeah. Not for fun, you don't want to get injured, guys. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because last time I play this table, so I pay for, for coach also for, for train the, so the, the best. The, this hobby is expensive. No? This, this hobby, like two, three hundred. Yeah. But if you buy good one, two thousand to four thousand ringgit. You can, you can start from the cheap one first. Yeah. Slowly. Yeah, slowly, up. slowly. Yeah. So, Abang, I want to see you do more stunts. Yeah. Is that possible? Can. Can we see you, please? Okay. <laughs> Show us again and again. All right, let's okay. go. Okay, let's go. <laughs> yeah. Yay. You guys having Thank fun, you. right? Okay. Learn, learn something, right? I told you. I know the best person. I know. Yes, so thank you so much, Abang Shah, for a oh, wonderful so. day. Yeah, so thank any you. motivational quotes that you can share with us, with our younger generation or that? Oh, that's from my, my dad, actually. That's respect yourself, love yourself, world becomes small to you. Respect, respect yourself, yourself, love yourself, yourself and, and the world will, will become, become small, small. Because we are so big like that. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> All right, thank you guys for watching us today. Don't forget to catch us next week on Our story began, we created a story, a double to our people and vision.